Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Tales of Vesperia. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, just gotten done dealing with the ruins and came on back now that we know the identity of the probable thief. Uh, we came back to the sealed city of scholars in Aspio where apparently we are not allowed to leave until we get uh, Rita back into the party. Which means we gotta go right back down here and talk to her. Find out what she's doing here. I guess a lot, because we're just waiting now. If you're that worried about Flynn, would you rather leave now? It's just... I've got to say a proper goodbye to Rita. Oh, okay. take it easy. What are you going to do after this, Yuri? Then don't freak out. What am I going to do? I guess I'll go pay a visit to the guy behind all this core stealing. Which is kind of what you should have been doing anyway. So, I mean, same. Different. I shouldn't be swearing this early in the episode. <clears throat> same stuff you were doing. Really? Yeah. It sounds like Dedeki ended up going to the same place, too. Yeah. So, it ends up working out. In that case, we should make a beeline for Nor Harbor! Didn't he say Torum Harbor? Oh, right. You don't know. Don't know what? Did it get renamed or something? Nor and Torum are both ports of a city that extend across two different continents. Oh. On the Elikian side, where we are now, is the port of Capua Nor. People call it Nor Harbor. Capua Torum mm -hmm. is the port on the other side, on the Tolbikian continent. It's usually just called Torum Harbor. Oh. Okay. So first we'll go to Nor Harbor. We'll have to pass by Emmied Hill on the way, but it's not that far west from here. Okay. I I'll be going back to Halor. I still need to follow Flynn. Oh. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I'll head back to Halor too. Huh? Why? How can you just say that? The thief's gonna get away! I mean, true, but... There's no reason to panic. According to our friend in the ruins, it sounds like his client's base there. Mm-hmm. Besides, if we're going west, that'll take us close to Hulur. Oh, man! True. But I... You gotta be somewhere? A sick girlfriend with an incurable disease or something? I mean, he's definitely acting like it. Man, if only she really was a frail girl like that. Oh... So there is a girl. I know I asked you to wait for me, but you sure made yourselves at home, didn't you? What else were we supposed to do? Oh, we're welcome waiting back. For you. What ended up happening to the thief? He's probably crying quietly to himself in his cell by now. Sorry for suspecting you. Finally, an apology out of Yuri. Wow. Who would have thunk it? <laughs> I was hoping for it, but I didn't actually believe it would happen. <laughs> what a heartfelt apology. I'll take it, though. It worked out pretty well for me, too. Rita? What is that face? Well, thanks for the hospitality. Mm -hmm. What? Going so soon? We don't want to overstay our welcome. Plus, we're in a bit of a hurry. Yeah, a bit of that. I'm so happy to have met you, Rita. I'm afraid we have to go now. I'll thank you properly later. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, tell me about this frail girlfriend of yours, Carol. What? The reason you want to go to Nor Harbor is so you can see her, isn't it? H how do you know about her? I knew it! No! Kinda let I mean, she's not even in Nor Harbor! A lot more than you Oh, it's not know. Nor Harbor? I, I don't know what you're talking about! You might as well come clean, Carol. It's obvious Estelle's not gonna give up. Yeah. You've got it all wrong! Carol! <sighs> You've let on too much info, boy, and now she has enough to go on. <laughs> Never give your women enough info to go on. Because <laughs> they will not let up. <laughs> Hell, don't give me enough info to go on. I won't let up either. 
being made to just women. I'm just a, I'm just as much of a gossip as Estelle. So I mean, if anything, <laughs> I shouldn't really talk. <laughs> anyway, I guess we're just leaving Rita behind. It's unfortunate, but eh. oh, if you're seeing us off, we'll say goodbye here. Yeah. I'm going with you. Uh oh. You're doing what? <laughs> okay. Oh, so this is why you told us not to leave without saying goodbye, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Is that it? Just yeah? Yeah, that seems to be just the answer. Carol, you 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 have a habit of sticking your nose. <laughs> you have a habit of sticking your nose in situations where it's going to get bit. Can you just leave like that? You're an important mage here, right? Hmm. Hmm? I want to see Halor's Barrier Blastia for myself. It's no good to the people if it's broken, right? I'm going to take it that she just came up with that idea on the fly. Actually, the three of us fixed it together. Huh? What do you mean you fixed it? You're just amateurs. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I think I know why I like Rita now. <laughs> because I see so much of myself in her. Holy fuck. I have said shit like that in the past so often. Like, how the fuck did you fix that at work when one of my most least trained... <laughs> Fucking employees fixes something that I was struggling over for a week and they just fix it. I'm like, how the fuck did you do that? You shouldn't know how to do that. What the f And turns out it was something so simple. <laughs> it was so simple that my dumb ass didn't think of it because I figured it had to be a lot harder than what it was. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> That's why I like her so much. Okay. All right. You know, we revived it. It was great. Let's just say it was beginner's luck. <laughs> Yuri's trying to save Rita's ego, and Carol... <laughs> Carol wanted to stoke his own, and or rather stroke his own. That's... No, mm-mm. His age, that is not a proper phrase to be using. But, hmm, stroke his own ego, stoke it, make it a roaring flame, and you're just like, shut up, kid. <laughs> All right. Now I'm really worried. I'll have to go see if it's been done properly or not. Okay. So she's not letting go of her story. Suit yourself. Okay. All right. What? Um. I've never had a real friend my own age before. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> she is younger than you, technically, but okay. I'm not so sure we're... This is going to be so much fun. I'm pretty sure she was going to say I'm not that sure we're friends. <laughs> but she's just not going to care. Estelle is too geeked about this whole prospect. Yeah. <laughs> and Rita is not. <laughs> oh boy when we left the capital it was just me repeating Estelle now Carol and Rita have joined us I'm so happy to have more people to travel with Say I'm not so now. sure about some people in our party though uh huh I'm not so sure about you you little runt hey now go easy on the young captain Rita we all have to work to get along okay oh yeah right To be fair, to be fair, Carol brought that on himself. <laughs> she was defending herself. <laughs> I feel like I'm saying this for someone else and not me. <laughs> Come on. Ah, shit. All right. Off we go. Ah, that's 
I had enough in the episode, I could swear. Okay. And I was just running against the boundary of the map. Okay. I wonder... Get away from me. Going to... Go around. Oh! Ow. I didn't know it could be like that sort of map. Okay. That's fine. That makes it a little easier. Uh, which... <clears throat> well, so much for going this way. Alright, away I go to get to the lower level, which you won't let me do here. Great. Ah! <clears throat> Sloppy. I'm going to try not to. Ow! I thought I was holding it long enough. Okay. Whoa. Not bad. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Nope. Not really at all. Isn't it hard to use a weapon that large, Carol? It's a little heavy, but I need to hold something large like this to make myself look bigger. It's just the right trick to hide your minuscule size. Ah, you want to look bigger to fool the enemies. Now that you mention it, small monsters often puff themselves up to appear more menacing. Right, it's just like... Huh? Are you saying I'm the same as a monster? Okay, you took Even so, way, changing your appearance doesn't change who you really are, Carol. Are you dangerous? Tell us right now if you are. It's okay. I'm an elite hunting blade. There's nothing to worry about. I hope that's not another one of your clever tricks. <laughs> oh, that's funny. No, no. Mm -mm. You, uh, you look. Mm. Leave it to me. Yeah, about that. <laughs> Ow! You Stop! Oh my God! 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 Get away! Them? Man, I was just getting warmed up. I forgot how Destruction Field looked. It's pretty cool, actually. It's a great detail. Oh, that wasn't too bad. I didn't realize I finished in under 10 seconds. Oh, oh I feel so powerful! Nice. Good for you. Have you been doing research in Ospio for a long time, Rita? Yeah, I guess about five years. Five years? Wow. Rita, how old are you anyway? I'm 15. W wow, you're so grown up. I can't believe you were researching Blastia at 10. It's not a big deal. How old are you, Estelise? Oh, um, I just turned 18 this year. Time to grow up. <clears throat> right. I'll do my best. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Holy fuck. Oh, come on. Don't get in my way! Well, they're intent on doing that. Destruction field! A flickering blaze! Fire! Fire! Yeah, I beat you into next week. Hell next yeah. week? But can you Finish really? In Never five mind. seconds. Holy shiza. It was just under five seconds, too. Look at that. Look at the time in the. Uh... Look at that. <laughs> Oh, wow, that was great. That was beautiful. Ow! Went that way and there's a rock in the way. Gah! Doug, dim it, damn it, owner of the Dimsdale, dim it, damn Oh, fuck you! Uh, I'm gonna do it! Yeah. Ha, 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 destruction! A flickering blade! Destruction! Star Street! That was annoying! Yeah, a little. I'm terrible though. Medium bird feather though. That's nice. I'm getting a lot of monster loot. I'm gonna make you work. Oh yeah. Ha, 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 destruction. There we go. Destroy Oh, I didn't realize how low on TP I was. Oh, flickering blaze burn. Fireball. Okay. Put out your hand. Like this? Yay! What, what was that? A high five. Hmm. Okay, sure. 
Oh boy, I see too much of myself in Rita. I see too much of myself in Rita. Ah! Mm. Our formation's all over the place! Bastards. Cowards! How's this? <laughs> hey, help me out when I'm casting! Cover. I'll protect you! Oh, Starstroke! Destruction! Nice. Starstroke! Okay. Man, I was just getting warmed up. Yep. Worked out pretty well, though. Took a little bit of damage, but we finished in under 20 seconds. So that's always something. And we got some pork. Hell yeah. What are you looking at? Burr. Hey, dog. You keep away. Huh? Rita, are you afraid of dogs? Not at all. Mind your own business. She absolutely is. Oh, no. Hey, Rita, I wanted to ask you about this... Oh, repeat. Repeat sure knows who he likes and who he doesn't. <laughs> okay, I'm getting the feeling repeat wants to understand Rita. Rita, being scared of dogs, doesn't want this. And repeat wants nothing to do with Estelle. <laughs> For reasons I don't know. But hey. <laughs> oh boy, okay, alright. Ah! Leave it to me! This is gonna be a thing. A little test! Like this? Uh, Yay! Yeah. What was that? Sacred tree. These are the threads that weave our future. Learn to cross counter and step away. Nice. Well, might as well run into Halur. That was where we were going. It's a side. Ooh. Hey! The tree's already blooming? <laughs> I told you! We brought the tree back to life! Oh, you've returned, just as the knight said. Oh, uh, yep, he was here, all right. Um, do you mean Flynn? Unfortunately, you just missed him. Uh, no way! Not again! Mm -hmm. He was quite surprised that the barrier had been fixed. Um, would you happen to know which way he went? N no, I I'm sorry, I, I don't know. Welp. However, he did entrust me with a letter. Hmm. Maybe that will tell us something. Hmm. Thank you, old man. <clears throat> what? What? A wanted poster? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Is that supposed to be a drawing of Yuri? <laughs> I guess I made a little too much mischief. Mm, yeah, just a little bit. What kind of mischief gets you into this? Uh, it's my fault. Yeah, it's a sales fault. Yeah, it's all her. It's all her. Point the finger at her. She did it. Oh, come on. Only 5,000 gold? <laughs> 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 That's something I would do. <laughs> what do you mean it's only like 500 bucks? What? I'm sure that should have cost way more. The fuck? Is this bullshit? <laughs> That's way too high for just breaking out of jail. You must have done something else. I mean... So, what does the letter say? I'm going to Nor Harbor. Well... Catch up with me. Okay. Catch up with me, huh? Easy for him to say. Yeah. He also writes that we should watch out for assassins. Well, he even knows we're being hunted. Yep, well, uh, that probably has something to do with that horribly drawn bounty letter. Sounds like this guy knows what he's doing. 
Yeah. Looks like we have some dangerous people after us now. What are you gonna do? Well, um... I'm going to go to Nor Harbor. I could pass on a message for you if you want. But... I... Think about what you want to do. I'm gonna go make sure Rita isn't causing too much trouble. That's probably for the best. We have kind of ignored what she's doing. Alright, so the other two are just sitting, waiting for me, I'm assuming. Uh -huh. This world is full of suffering, but looking at the flowers in this city makes me glad that I'm alive. Well, hey, how about that? Welcome, may I help you? Uh, I kind of want to do some synthesis, see if I can build up some stuff. 60% of max HP. That would be very nice. But I do not have enough medicinal herbs. Well, I do actually have enough for one, but... Uh... Air agaric? Special gel. I would need a mystic orb for that. Lottery gel? Maybe it's something good, maybe it's not. You won't know until you try it. I don't think I need that. But I feel like it would be funny. So why not? It only cost me seven gold to make. As opposed to a lemon gel, which costs me 750. But it might be good to have in the back pocket. There we go. Hmm. hmm. Weapon wise. Hmm. He's currently equipped with an Oka. An Oka. But we could upgrade it to an Oka plus one, which would make it significantly better by eight. Also gives him a chance to learn Recover. Okay. I'm currently equipped with a longsword. Estelle has their rapier. So, I'm not going to do that. Iron Salad. I'd rather Soleil. I, I don't remember how that's pronounced. Shapka. A fluffy hat. A must-have for cold weather. Well, I mean, okay. But, this would give me more armor, for sure. Shapka is available for repeat. So, I mean... There's that. <laughs> Iron Circlet would be good for the other two. Helps to increase the power of a spell as well. I don't know what they're equipped with, though. So I don't want to do that quite yet. Um, I have an Iron Guard. Hmm. Hmm. Oh! Didn't know I could make accessories either. Okay. Huh. Well, I can make leather boots. Don't need the cape. It's not that badly. Hmm. That's not what I meant to hit. I meant to look at material info. Beast skin. Why is the beast skin a tiger skin? That upsets me. <laughs> but okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, leather boots is its own thing. Poison ward. 50% chance of preventing poison, slightly resistant to water. I guess that makes sense. Hmm. Special flag 
it allows you to change party leaders in the menu. It won't give you an extra life. Well, that's unfortunate, but hey, it is what it is. Okay, well, let's go to repeat and... Oh, he's already equipped with it. Nice. And did he already learn everything from that? Yes, he did. Okay, cool. All right. Uh, I don't have anything to give to him. What about myself? Currently wearing ringmail. Leather helm. That's why the Soleil would be probably better. Hmm. I might as well make it just for myself right now, especially since I don't know if I would need to for uh, the other one. Uh, fuck, I forgot his name already. It was... Carol, there we go. My brain is broken. <laughs> My brain is not very functional today. Alright. Pop that on. It's nice. Very nice. And if I need to give the leather helm to uh, Carol, then I will do that. Ring. I think I'm good. I think I'm good for right now. Okay, up we go. Go past. Stell, I have to. Flynn. Yep, looks like she's struggling with the decision a little bit, which makes sense. Is there any of my party members down here? No, doesn't look like it. So I guess we both... Well, both of them are probably up near the tree right now. Yeah. No, wait. Carol's here. Carol's here. I don't understand Yuri anymore. And Estelle, too. <laughs> well... Uh, fair enough. I mean, can't blame you for that. I can't believe it. I've never seen anything like this. The flowers are in full bloom, even though it's not the season for it. And the barrier's strong, too. Did Estelise really do this? What do you mean? Yeah. Carol let it slip when we were leaving Ospio. You tried to change the subject, but it was too late. Yeah, I figured she would have caught that. Guess I blew that one. Mm-hmm. We may just have nothing even remotely like she has. So you just decided to come with us to eliminate the competition? <sighs> Don't be ridiculous. I have a formula that I have to work out. Okay, sorry for the accusation. Although, technically, it wasn't me making that. I assumed that it was probably, you know, justifiable. I didn't think it was that. Jesus, Yuri, calm down. But, uh, I figured she was probably trying to work on an idea to do this. And then, lo and behold, Estelise did it for her. And now she's like, what did I miss? How the fuck did I not do this? Just some rando from the castle did it. A formula? What do you mean? It's hmm. nothing. Forget about it. Uh, of course. So what did you want? You came here for something, right? Well, that just took care of about half of it. Yeah. So, what's the other half? You said that it's easy working with Blastia because they never betray you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so? You and Estelle are both human. You're not Blastia. Mm -hmm. Oh, I get it. You're worried for her. Worried I might hurt her. Okay, that was an accusation. Estelle's honest. Good. Unlike you or me. I'm just saying, don't do anything reckless. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's go back. Carol and Estelle are waiting for us. I finally found the clue I was looking for. I want to be all kinds of reckless. Okay. Rita's rejoined the party. All right. Wow, I've never seen this many flowers on Halor's tree before. Huh? 
Doesn't it always get like that when the flowers are in season? In season or out, I've never seen all the buds blooming at once like this. Really? Guess we're lucky to get to see something so amazing. I'd say it's more abnormal than amazing. I mean, por que no las dos? All right, with her equipment, I should probably check that too. Now that I think about, it. yeah, the sash. I think she's already learned all of that, and all of that too. Amber cloak, leather boots, bronze circlet. Probably is ideal to change that circlet. All right, and Carol's not here. Okay. Yep. So much for trying to find him over here. Puppy. Woof woof. Oh. Well, I guess we'll make those things for, uh... Unless there is better stuff. Hand axe is not good for me <laughs> at all. Um... Wood maul, not good for him, I'm sure. Uh, shapka... I could just buy it, or I could make it. Interesting. A uh, leather jacket, no. Chain guard, no. Ring mail. Oh! Bread and egg. I guess I could get more. I might as well get six. Top it up to ten. There we go. Alright, and... Well, I mean, might as well save my materials. Buy that. Yeah, and get it for repeat, I think. That's a good idea. Alright, and these are absolutely a no-go. Paralysis bottle. Huh? I guess I'll need these at some point, but for right now, not so much. Okay, synthesis... Um, oh, I can upgrade her chain to also give her evade. Hmm. And it hmm, just requires a paralyzed powder to upgrade it. Okay. Fair enough. Really, an iron circlet would only go down for her. Interesting. Other than the bronze circlet. Okay. And she already has an amber cloak, so don't need to worry about that. Um, poison ward. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alright, well. Come again. Yeah, well, I will. I'm just going to equip repeat with that, that, the shapka, because the knit cap is not worth it anymore. Actually, now I think about it, should I sell that knit, knit cap, as, among other things? Should I sell some of these things? I don't know. Especially since I can't break them down into base materials. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like I should hold on to this. At least this. I'm pretty sure I don't need that. This I'm still not sure about. So, I guess we'll sell all that. Let's sell that. Now I'll hold on to that. Just in case. I'll sell that other thing. Whoopsie doodle, that's not what I meant. Um, a cloak. Probably for the best to sell that. Hmm. Then again, I don't know. I know the Iron Guard is near worthless, so I might as well just sell that. I'm not going to sell all of that. Hell no. 
now that I know that these things are useful for other things. I'm not going to sell that. All right. Okay. Yeah, I feel like it. And then when I collect the other two, then I'll finish up the whole upgrade tree shenanigans I was doing. Now, uh, come back with us while you can. Oh, boy. Damn it, LeBlanc. I say, we've come to courteously escort you back to the capital. Uh-huh. And then we can clamp Yuri in chains where he belongs. Okay. I've been waiting for you, Yuri Lowell. Don't you move a muscle. Uh-huh. Jeez, this guy never lets up, does he? Nope. An old acquaintance you may be, but today I can overlook your transgressions no longer. Good Yuri to isn't know. a bad person. I asked him to go with me. Yeah, Yuri, you ruffian! You're coercing Lady Astelis! Of course. No, this is what I really want. I'll go back to the castle. Just leave me be for a little longer. I cannot allow that. Return to the castle with us. Mm -hmm. I can't go back. Please understand this. We have no choice. We'll have to apprehend the criminal as well. Great. Lovely. All right. Kiss your freedom goodbye, or it ends today. Wow. What's this bar on the left-hand side? That's new. I say, prepare to face the Imperial Knight's ultimate fighting art, the Overlimit. Aha. Uh -huh. The Overlimit doesn't belong to the Knights. Anyone can do it last time I checked. Mm -hmm. I say be quiet. <laughs> Yuri, what's an Overlimit? <laughs> this is how we introduce me to the mechanic, okay. It's a technique to increase your abilities while fighting. How do you do it again? You fool! How could you forget something like that? I, mean, I say I shall jog your memory, but after that, I say I shall give you a non-stop ticket on the train of death! Okay, calm down, Edgelord. Jesus. First, <laughs> attack! Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Curse you! Yeah! Attack! Attack! Uh huh. All right, you attack the enemy, and that raises your battle spirit. Mm -hmm. Blast! Your hits are not connecting at all. Oh, that brings that a one. Hurts. I say that hurt. I cannot, I say, stand this any longer. You throw I say into a lot of weird places. Oh yeah, your battle spirit goes up if you're attacked too. Hmm. Gauge fills up as you attack or when you receive an attack. Okay. All right. And then, if you release the battle spirit that you've stored up... Mm-hmm. Press to go into overlimit. Okay. I'll blow you ah. away! That's enough for today. Okay. Wow! Yuri, that's amazing! Yeah, for now. You can use basic attacks and arcs consecutively during an overlimit. Oh. So it just goes all in a row at once, okay? We mustn't let his power charge Instead up anymore! Just the normal three combo limit, okay. I've got right. you just where I want you. Uh-huh. Ow! That's Son of a bitch. Okay. No, I'm not. You use this anything. Come on. Odin of this There we go. Took him out. That's him. This is this is my comeback. That's for it. Just done this. There we go. Down you go. Nice work, men. I'm sorry. I can't go back. <laughs> nice work. <laughs> just talking down to them the entire time because I just beat their asses. It's no grade because I didn't do well, but at least it didn't negatively impact a grade, which is nice. Okay.
Could have been worse. <sighs> what a shame. Oh, yeah. What a shame that your jobbers are just complete garbage. Uh, Rita. Oh, Rita. She says she's not going back, so get lost. Well, that's Yuri, nice of her. It's them again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Not these Damn it. Boards. I knew they were still after us. What is it this time? What do you mean? I'll explain later. Carol, which way is Nor Harbor? Well, so uh, much for the upgrading uh, of everyone's it's equipment. West. West. You go over a meat hill and Capua Nor is right there. Go over a meat hill and Capua Nor is right there. All right, okay. let's go now then. But I can't. Shut up and uh, just come with us. Make a decision. Exactly. Thank you. Which do you really want to do? Keep traveling with us or go home? I'm going to keep traveling. Well, then, a come wise on. choice, and one that those knights surely wouldn't be able to agree with. Uh -huh. Imperial Knight Point One. With this sword, I shall protect the people, wasn't it? Uh -huh. So, Indeed. Do that. Come on, boys. Let's show them what the Imperial Knights are made of. Thank you. For once. I'm sorry. For once, they help me. A new page has been added to the battle book about the over limit. Reunite with Estelle and Carol. <sighs> Wish I could have done the upgrading of equipment like I was planning. But I don't really have a choice in that now, do I? Oh, hello. Bye bye. The Mead Hill, huh? Is it this way? Maybe? Possibly. So this is Emmied Hill? I yeah. Guess I was right. But what do you mean, but? What do you mean, but? That's weird. The barrier's gone. Uh, you mean there was a barrier here? There was when I came before. Sort of a waste to have a barrier in a place with no people, if you ask me. True. Are you sure you aren't mistaken? I'm pretty familiar with the barrier locations, but here... You just haven't heard about this one. Nan mm -hmm. told me it was only put here recently. Nan. Who is Nan, Carol? Huh? Uh, she's... Uh, you know, she's just a friend from my guild. The girlfriend who's frail, huh? Uh, I'm gonna go see if I can find anything out. Uh-huh. I think I'll have a look myself. Okay. All right, never mind us, guys. I'm not gonna go look for them if they get lost. <laughs> yes, you are. Shall we, Yuri? Okay, well. New page has been added to the battle book, and I guess we're going to explore here a little little bit to... Hey, hey, no outsiders allowed! Shut up! Let me through! I'm Rita Mordio of the Imperial Blastia Research Laboratory. Oh, you're a mage from Ospio. Excuse me. Well, that worked. Oh, but you can't just do as you please. Let me go and ask the... Shut up. <laughs> I could use some of her attitude. <laughs> I think you have plenty already. You're not wrong, Estelle. <laughs> hey, listen to this! Okay. Thank you, Carol, for the ear piercing, ear piercing pitch. Oh boy, my ability to words is not helping either. It was like bam! A spear went thunk, the blastio went bang, and he flew off into the sky like whoosh! Very descriptive. Thank you, Carol. You are so excited. Who did what? what how? how? Uh huh? <laughs> Someone riding a flying dragon. Um. Threw a giant spear at the Blastia, and then um, just flew off. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry. Can you? Run that by me again? Someone riding a flying dragon threw a spear at the Blastia to destroy it and then just went away. 
What? A human riding a dragon? No way. Thank you, Yuri. Someone who speaks sense. I've never heard of anything like that before. Nope. That's what I thought too, but a bunch of people here saw it happen. They say it was a dragon rider. A dragon okay. rider? <laughs> well, the world's just full of surprises. I'd say. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Let me go! Okay, what's going on here? There she goes again. <sighs> Something is definitely strange with this Blastia formula. Oh. There's nothing strange at all. Perhaps you are... Don't... Don't start. Just who do you think I am? Son, don't start. I'm well aware of who you are. The famed genius mage, correct? Uh-huh. But surely there are some formulas that even you aren't familiar with. That might be the case, but you don't think that she might help with some? You can't use a weird formula like this. Think of the poor Blastia. Wait, poor Blastia. Hey, stop gawking and help us catch her. How about... Fire! Hey! Fire! What's well... with that kid? Was that just an attempt at a distraction a fire? or what, Carol? I don't hear anything or smell anything. Yeah. Hey, you little liar. <laughs> Crap, yep. they cut on that fast? <laughs> For real? You just screamed fire. What? Did you really think that would work? Are you for real right now, Carol? Well, I got hey, most of them off. You were with that kid. Uh-huh. Wait a minute. You, there's ah, a warrant fuck. for your... Shut up. Hey! It's now or never. That's now or never. Uh, Get out of here. Little... Hey, wait! <laughs> Thank you, Rapid. I'm sorry. Well, so much for going over the hill. Hey, stop goofing off and help catch that kid. <clears throat> yeah, about that. Damn! Carol left the party for now. Uh-oh. Welp. Now we're going up this way. Whew, looks like we lost him. For now, yeah. Hey, repeat. Rita, you should really think more before you act. Uh-huh. That barrier blessed you was just so strange. I couldn't help myself. Mm -hmm. Strange? Something fishy about it? I have a feeling that may be an understatement. Mm-hmm. Well, our hands are already full as it is. So could you please keep us out of it? It doesn't concern you, regardless. Mm -hmm. Yuri Lowell! Where have you run off to now? Oh, for fuck's sake. Hey, Mr. Famous. Sounds like you've got a fan out there. Shut up. Again? Well, that gives a new meaning to the word workaholic. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Also, wow, my stomach made a lot of noise. I should probably get food <laughs> after this episode's done. Lady Esteles, I say, do come out of hiding. Uh, of course. You guys have a lot of problems. Just who are you, anyway? Yep. Um, well, I'm... Mm-hmm. Yuri, come out! Come out wherever you are! You can talk about that later. Yeah. Especially when we're not being hunted. Uh, wait, okay, well, wait, it's Carol. me! Ah, Carol! Don't frighten us like that! Well, I mean, Rapid was already on the case, so it's not... Anyway, like it's let's get our butts to Nor Harbor before things get any more complicated. Yeah. Which way were we supposed to go again? Over the hill. Let's see. As the crow flies... Mm -hmm. Isn't this a beast trail? Can we really go through here? Not we'll go as far choice. as we can, at least. I don't want to get captured again. We'll yeah, need to be fair. on the lookout for monsters, then. Mm -hmm. eh, what are one or two monsters to the brave Captain Carol? Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Though if the barrier were up, we wouldn't have to worry about Jesus, monsters at stomach. all. Calm down. Yeah, true. 
Oh, I can't stand it. Why does some idiot have to go around breaking Blastia and making our lives difficult? Well, the plot wouldn't be pushed forward if they didn't. So, okay. Hey, Estelle. I noticed you keep looking in my direction. What's up? You don't mind if I ask? All right. Well, then, here goes. Oh, boy. This man. Are you in love with her? <laughs> <laughs> man is a girl's name, right? Is she the girl you wanted to show Halur's flowers to? Oh, my God. No! Estelle, stop it. No, no, no. You got it all wrong. <laughs> You're I embarrassing do? the poor boy. Man, she'd be so angry if she heard you say that. Oh, Carol, good luck with her. I'm oh. rooting for you. <laughs> Uh, Don't stop yeah. It. Well, thanks. That's encouraging. Yeah. Yep. Way to. <laughs> Way to encourage the poor boy. <laughs> okay, my stomach is not going to shut the fuck up. I'm going to end the episode just so I can get food. All right. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat. Playing games and just trying to make my way to the harbor. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> just, it keeps getting complicated along the way. It just keeps getting worse and worse. But we're learning more about our companions as we go. Uh, apparently, uh, the Blastia have a sort of feeling, I guess? Or feelings they could have, according to Rita. Um, Carol is, you know, just a goofy-ass kid who apparently has a crush on a girl, uh, as much as he doesn't want to admit it. And Estelle is just going to constantly butt her nose where it doesn't belong in that regard. But... She's also being hunted by the uh, Imperial Knights, technically in a different fashion than me. But uh, yeah, that's going to make a lot of things complicated. Wahoo, gotta love that for you.